Wait, so what did we do last week? Whoa, well, I just got deja vu, man. <laughs> Hi, guys. Welcome to Lee Reacts. I hope everyone's having a good day. I know I am. And we are back with our weekly CSN video. CSNY, I guess, technically here. Um, I didn't have any requests this week, so I wanted to go back to 4-Way Street because... Wow, yeah, the one song we did from it was fantastic. So we're going to be doing two Graham Nash tracks from uh, this live album. Chicago and Right Between the Eyes. Uh, the Chicago is the last track on side one, and then side two, it's uh, track one, Right Between the Eyes. Both written by Graham Nash. Uh, they're kind of short tracks, that's why I kind of bundled them together, and they're both Nash tracks. I'm trying to like get into his stuff more. I know there's a solo one, uh, his album Songs for Beginners, that I, everyone keeps telling me to check out, and I really plan on doing that. Hopefully someone can request it so I can make an excuse to do it like quicker, but it's just my list is really long, so... You know, I gotta do what I gotta do. But this one I picked out because I uh, I love this album and I want to hear more from it. So let's go. If y'all are not subscribed, we do this every Saturday around like 11 a.m. I guess Eastern Standard Time. Come hang out in the chat. It's always some random thing. Last week we did two tracks from Deja Vu and we had just finished up, you know, the CSN 90 or CSN 77 album. We did all three of the or the whole out the whole album basically, um, which is a very, that was a very it was kind of a departure for them, but it was still really, really good. And, like, I liked that they experimented a little bit with it. So, you know, I digress. Let's go. Leave a comment and a like, too, if you're not busy. I appreciate it. First up, Chicago by Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young. Three, two, one, go. This is a song for Mad Daily. <laughs> Hey Nash, I see you. Dude, some of those nits, uh, that, that was insane. Some of those notes he was hitting are just nuts. I tried to say nuts and notes at the same time. It came out as nits. 
This is a song that you have not heard of Graham Natchez. So this is like two songs they did impromptu there or something? Wow. started on the same note, but you could do it. I didn't believe you either. <laughs> He's quicker than most normal human beings, and sometimes Can I we try again? Yeah. It's very quick. Don't want to play mumbly peg with him, he'll steal your leg. <laughs> he'll steal your leg. Uh, this is a, a song about changes that everyone else, you know, goes through at the same time. Thoughts of him in mind. Tis sacrilege for us to take advantage of the blind. So tell before you come to me from out of yonder skies. A man's a man who looks a man right between the eyes. I don't think he could beat Please don't ask me how I know I've just been up that street And all the people living there Have been silenced by their own lies A man's a man who looks a man Right between the eyes Is absolutely gorgeous. And talking from experience, I know how he would feel. Waking up and finding that his one love wasn't real. But the age of truth will soon appear Aquarius arrives A man's a man who looks a man Right between the eyes Damn. I feel like Nash is the most overlooked one for me, you know, compared to, you know, Captain Crosby, Stills, and of course, Neil Young. Like, Nash is almost like the odd man out and like, the stuff that I've listened to and really gotten into. But it really started with uh, with Cathedral on the CSN 77 album we did. That one really, like, brought my interest to him because that, that was one of the most beautifully constructed hard-hitting songs i'd listened to in a long time and especially from them you know it was it was masterful uh it's probably de definitely the best song in that album and um he's got such like a writing talent that like it's almost like neil young in a way that like his lyrics are it's like deceptively simple at points but it just really i don't know they, they hit really hard like the, the just the way that he just brings attention to certain things I think, you know, him, it was like almost like an anti, if the song's name was Chicago and he's talking about like corruption and, you know, it's almost like an anarchist plea, it felt like at points, but, you know, like if you are just going to throw the book at a guy for some bullshit that he didn't even do or he did do, you know, you know, it's the whole system is very messed up and um, I can't get too deep in it because they listen to this, you know, that obviously now, but um, it the whole, let's say the PIC, uh, it's a very big money-making operation that has always been a 
just uh, chew you up and spit you out kind of business. And there are a lot of them are privately owned. Um, and they're all privately funded. Some of them are, and then of course there's the you know state-run, federal-run facilities, and it's just uh, it's a racket, like most things are in this country and the world. It feels like uh, obviously you need those things for you know criminals and such, but I feel like you know there's a lot of people that uh, the, you know sometimes the law is not fair to, and uh, yeah. Hopefully we're going to work in a better direction to be better. <laughs> it's a better country, man. I don't know. Because our, our our justice system is something. It's a piece of work. Um, I've been through it multiple times. L- luckily, I got out with a couple months of jail and like a year at some st- facility up in New York, you know. But I deserved a lot more for the shit I did probably. But it is what it is. That was a beautiful song though, man. Like both of them. They both were very... Like the piano was the main, you know, instrumental in the first one, and, and then the guitar for Nash and the harmonies, of course, throughout. And just there's magical band, man. No matter who's writing the songs, no matter who's singing, it's just the harmonies always there, and the instrumentals always there. And I think that was a great uh, pick for a kind of a somber, not somber Saturday. Let's not call it that. Let's just call it a we're um, I don't know. This is sort of a relaxed kind of Saturday, and. I think that was a perfect vibe to fit the rest of the songs we're listening to today. I don't know about you guys, though. I really enjoyed that. If I had to pick one, that's kind of hard. I'd have to go with the. I'd go with the first one, even though "Right Between the Eyes" had a really nice, like that that line, you know, "Right Between the Eyes." I think that's a good line. But the first one is just uh, had a little more to it with the piano and everything. But that is it. Thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed that. I will see you next week for another CSM video. You rock. Y'all know the Patreon right here. That is a picture of it. There is a link in the description. If you join the $15 tier or up, you get one free request a month. If you join any of the tiers, you get access to all of our block videos and full album reactions. Uh, you also you can send a request through PayPal or, um, or tip if you'd like to. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see y'all later. Bye.